Hey, what's up guys? It's Brian here, Brian's Law Maintenance. All right, we got another cleanup vlog that we're doing for you guys today. Just taking you guys through the day in the life, right? You guys can see where we're at so far. We got the zero turn, and then look at the dump insert, man. We're doing a property uh, right down the road here, and there is a lot of tall grass. It's right there, and it's through a gated backyard. We're just able to squeeze the mower through there and get it in, and uh, which is good because then we can actually haul all that tall grass over to the dump insert, but another cleanup. Uh, we actually got two, so that one and then this house right behind me so we're gonna get a two four uh, hopefully uh, probably about four four hundred twenty five bucks by the time we're done should take about three hours which is nice but it feels good to be back out there doing some spring cleanups all right guys we'll catch up with you guys inside the video All right guys, so what's up? My name is Brian here at Brian's All Maintenance and hopefully you guys are doing well. But anyway, if you guys are new to the channel, I'm all about helping you guys grow a more successful business. So don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new and I can check. No, I'm just having fun. But uh, anyway, I had to grab the camera out. It's been a minute since we've been able to do another cleanup vlog just because we have been having some crappy weather. We've got a ton of rain. Uh, I guess nothing to really complain about compared to some of you guys out in the Midwest and North west northwest midwest you guys got like three to eight inches of snow uh, last couple days which is crazy but anyway take a look at the dump insert here this is literally just all the straw type grass i hate it got some spirea and then underneath this is uh cleanup work from two weeks ago because the dump insert was only about a third full and i'm not paying the 25 five dollar base minimum to uh go dump all my stuff so just let it sit so I gotta dump that by the end of the day. Maybe we'll be able to show you guys that. But anyway, let's go jump on the mower. Let's go do some leaf cleanup work and we'll catch up with you guys here in just a minute.
All right, guys. Hey, quick little intermission here. So let's get a little update where we're at so far. Uh, really enjoying the cleanup. Hey, by the way, a couple things. Man, so much to talk about. So little time, right? Um, I don't get to see you guys about every once or twice a week doing more mowing vlogs, which I know you guys appreciate. But I uh, wanted to let you guys know that I did pick up a bunch of pants from Duluth. Uh, this is actually something that I really appreciated you guys weighing in on one of the frequently asked question videos. If you guys haven't checked out that video series, I'll leave a card right here or something like that. That way you can check that out. But check these out. This is the um, Cool Technology Flex Pant. I'm not sure what you call them exactly, but a lot of you guys recommended these, and I'll tell you what, they have been awesome. We've been doing cleanups with them for uh, about two weeks. I bought, dude, five pairs. It was like 300 bucks. They're not cheap, man. They're like 70, 80 bucks at Duluth. Um, we have a Duluth store right uh, by where I live, which is really convenient. Uh, so I thank you to all of you guys who let us know about the pants. Um, and then the other thing I was gonna tell you, oh, hey, if you haven't checked out Instagram, we have Brian's Law Maintenance stickers. It looks just like this crest right behind me. So if you guys haven't and you want stickers, we can now participate in sticker swap. So as soon as I get the opportunity to get uh, a garage figured out here, which we're trying to move here in the next couple weeks and months, um, I will definitely throw your stickers up on either my tool chest or we're probably gonna make a cool um, like a sign thing that we're gonna hang behind the, the workbench. It's gonna be really dope. So if you guys want a sticker, don't leave it in the comments. Shoot me an email. Shoot me an email and the subject line that says sticker swap. And I'd love to get you guys a Brian's Law Maintenance sticker. So thank you guys for supporting everything what we're doing. I'm so excited to have stickers. It's finally cool. I can start you know, exchanging them with you guys. And as soon as I have my wall, I can't wait to plaster this whole thing up with all of your stickers because I've been hoarding them already for like the last six months or so. Hang loose, hopefully we get that whole setup figured out here, trying to move and all that mess. So anyway, um, let me just take you guys really quick. I'll show you guys this cleanup we just did. It actually turned out really nice. I'll look both ways before crossing the street, right? Uh, hopefully the camera captures how nice it looks. The sun's kind of peeking out. That looks really, really good. All right, so this is the one we just got done. This one ended up being 245. Clean up the boulevard, the front. We pruned a bunch of spirea on the sides and uh, hosses and daylilies on the right. And in the back, he had these tall grasses, which was such a pain in the butt because we could barely get the mower through here because he's got these huge 20 foot tall arborvitaes. So anyway, uh, it took us a little over an hour. We're gonna charge 245 just for all the pruning. So you guys can see all the way down here, we had to get all these tall grasses, uh, which was such a pain in the butt because I could barely fit the mower here. I had to take off the uh, vacuum system and the tube to be able to go through here. The deck just fit perfectly, but once we have the new stand on mower, we should be able to fit back there. That's about as the capacity I'll do for a gated backyard. So, but thankfully we have the 52 star S switch. By the way, for all of you guys that watched all the way to the end of videos, you saw on my uh, yard book one year review video that we're picking up our new equipment uh, either Thursday or Friday. I'm super excited about that. We got two new mowers coming from Xmark. We got the Laser Z X series, just like the mower I have, but a brand new one. And then we're gonna be running the 52 Starus. I'm so excited about Team Xmark, right? So if you're Team Xmark, leave me a comment down below. All right, guys, I'm gonna go jump back on the uh, mower start cleaning this stuff up. Brandon's in the back working on this one. So the first one's 245. This one will probably be 125, 145. What is that? Uh, two, three, 385, 390 in about three hours. So that's okay. And look at the dump, man. Just caked full. So anyways, if you guys are liking the vlogs, let me know. Leave a comment down below. If you guys are doing cleanups as well, where are you guys at in the season? Some of you guys, like I said earlier, man, have been getting six inches of snow, which is That'll set your uh, whole calendar back two weeks, right? So anyway, jump back on the mower and, oh hey, let me show you guys how I actually do this. So you guys been enjoying the POV? So that's what I do, I put on the ROPS bar. Figure it out, you know, works pretty well so far and you guys have been enjoying it and I kinda like that first person view. So anyway, time to throw the camera back in the truck, get back out there, I don't want Brandon to uh, yell at me. He's actually the boss, I'm just uh, a lackey today. So, <laughs> all right, we'll see you guys in a minute.
All right, guys, so we just got done doing the two cleanups. Hey, it's Brandon. What's up, man? Hey, you got stickers coming, too. What is today? Say Wednesday? Yeah. They should be here today. <laughs> He's sandbagging, dude. I told him, he goes, I'm just going to get 100 because I don't know if people are going to want my stickers. So DM okay. him on Instagram no, no, if you no, want no. his stickers. I got 100 and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> While you supplies get... last. <laughs> well, <laughs> here, you take the camera. I got to throw my turf off. That's funny right there. I said, why don't you order 500? He's like, nobody's going to want my stickers. And so if you guys want a sticker, like I said, shoot him a DM. While supplies last. While supplies last. Dude, I spent $500 to get you guys all stickers. They're not cheap. They're not cheap, man. I, I had no idea. When 200 emails came in, uh, I, I told the wife, I said, oh no. Like, Yeah, what did we get ourselves into? I was like, we need to get like another mulch job on the books just to pay for freaking stickers, but I appreciate the support. So I was just, I thought it was pretty funny, you know? Ugh. So. King of the hill. Yeah, right. Well, I'm excited about, uh, I might put another wall, uh, another board on this. Everybody's been telling me to, you know? Oh. Put another board on there for mulch. Because uh, you just put another board on yours last night, right? Yeah, I did another 12-inch uh, extension. I don't know. I see. So mine already came with the 12-inch board, but uh, I decided to do another 12 inches. But yeah. who knows? I might even go another 12, depending on you know what I'm able to fit with mulch. Sure. Um, for what I got, but I see a lot of guys, like I said, with the two board, like mine for sure. But going as much as like three or four right. uh, boards. So we'll see. Shut I just up. don't want it to look too tacky, you know what I mean? Nah, it's all about nah. image too. I would you know? do three boards, I'd do at least two. Yeah. C and uh, C and I, I call him pizza, candy pizza. But C and I long hair, he just got a, uh, a dumper dog as well. And he put, uh, I think, boards on his. He had the mulch. Right. Like that like maroon yep. F-150. Looks really good, so I'm going to do the same thing. I always let you guys try it first, and then I do mine. <laughs> so, um, we're going to take this whole rig down to spurt our dump, which is across the street. So we'll do that. And then maybe we can shoot some video dumping this while we're there. Yeah. But we'll keep this day going. Another day in the life. All right. Enough uh, enough chit chat and we're out of here. We gotta go make some money. We'll catch up with you guys here in a few minutes. All right, guys. Brandon is unhooking the trailer really quick. And we are dropping the trailer off. Rot her because the dump is that way and there's nowhere to turn around. So knocking that out. Brandon's actually gonna grab the uh, wheel chocks really quick so we can leave this here. I don't want the trailer to roll backwards or anything. But one thing I wanted to show you guys was the impact kit that one of you guys uh, sent me and showed me. I haven't done a vlog, tons of little updates, man, but there's something that I want to show you guys. All right, so here's the wheel chocks. You guys have seen those on Instagram. You wanna throw those behind the wheel for me? Yeah. Just one or two, just so it doesn't move, because this is on the hill. And then this is something, it can't be a Brian's Law Maintenance video without a product plug, right? But uh, for real, one of you guys DM'd me on Instagram, which I really appreciate. I always say YouTube's a two-way street, and I was changing that flat tire on one of our previous vlogs, and you guys got me the impact socket set uh, to do wheel uh, lock uh, lugs, which is really cool. So let me just show you guys this really quick. So here's the deal. I like this and they're interchangeable, which is pretty sweet. So anyway, this is what I'm gonna be using for our wheel uh, lug nuts when we gotta change them on the tire. So I think the kit was like 20 bucks and it's available on Amazon Prime. This one's by Ares or A-R-E-S. So if you guys wanna check this out, this is uh, an additional impact socket set that I got from you guys to uh, Take care of the lug nuts, like I said, when we have a flat tire. All right, let me show you guys really quick what we're talking about here. So we got the extension piece on the inside. I just want to show you this so you guys can check it out. So here you go. Uh, we have the 19 millimeter for this that seemed to fit the best. But see, now I can actually get the impact gun from here to lock that down. Uh, the tire we changed was on the, actually it was one of these two. So I got to check that out. But um, anyway, I thought it was pretty cool. All right, guys, that's it. Let's go get back to the dump. Let's go get rid of all this. All right, guys, we're at the dump. And I don't even think I can give you guys this place do it justice. It's crazy how much stuff is here. Hey, we're at your favorite place. Yeah, this is my favorite place. It's not bad, though. I'm surprised it's not muddy after all the rain we got. Oh, I know. Hopefully I was... they keep up on it this year, because usually this place is like a freaking a mud pit. One day I'm going to bring the drone and fly it here so people can see how big this place is. Yeah. Because this is literally 200 yards deep of just compost. Oh, there's compost. hundreds and hundreds. There's Dude. probably a couple thousand yards of yeah. stuff here. This is, I think I mean? they said like 30 acres or 20 acres. I have no idea. Something crazy I don't know like if that. he's burning something over here or what? Well, there's a huge Volvo over there spinning. But uh, all right. Uh, here, I'll give you the camera. Let me use the uh, the dump. Yes, okay. sir. Yes, sir. You gonna use the dump from this side? I'm gonna have to go around. It's crazy. How's your dump trailer been working? Good. Yeah. No complaints. Way better than unloading it by hand. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> that was the best thing I ever bought. That right. and that truck. <laughs> You're gonna have to pull forward. Pull forward? Yeah. How are we looking? Good. It's all up? All cleaned out. Woo! That's not too bad considering that stuff was like compacted wet. Yeah. That stuff was in there for like two weeks. Once you get a few rounds going out of there, usually that stuff slides. I know the first few times I dumped it was super sticky. Yeah, yeah. Looks yeah. good. Scratch up the paint a little bit. Sure beats pitchfork and yeah. how many times have we done that? Dude, we know guys that have been in business for what, 30 plus years now that still unload their trailers with a pitchfork. I'm not doing that's that. That's insane. Dump trucks and dump trailers. Yep. This, uh, this one is uh, by buyers if you guys don't know. A little shout out to those guys. Game changer for my business model, but all right, we're jumping back in. Um, actually, you know what? I think I'm just gonna cut it right here just because I don't want this vlog to get too long for you guys. Um, if you guys have enjoyed it, shoot us a big thumbs up. We super appreciate it. And then again, don't forget to shoot a DM to him. And it's <laughs> <laughs> and if you're not following me, go to Instagram. Yeah. You can find me. I'm under uh, Envision Landscape Solutions. For so sure. I'm trying to hit 13,000 followers. So <laughs> I need another 100. Get me there. <laughs> we gotta do it. He's like, it's not moving. <laughs> do it for the gram, right? So anyway, we're having fun. Um, and by the way, if you guys want a sticker from me, um, don't forget to email me subject line sticker swap and then your name your address your info and all that mess and i'll get you guys hooked up but um little birdie out there we might be doing a giveaway regarding the stickers so if you have a sticker slap it on your favorite piece of equipment stay tuned for a future vlog we'll cover all that but hopefully uh we'll catch up with you guys here before you know it over and out see you guys see you guys